guys, welcome to GriffoMedia.com. I'm Griffo. I feel it necessary to do a video today on the PS4 with this game here. Oh yes, Grand Theft Auto 5. I'm going to show you how this works with a racing wheel. It's true, it does work. Here's the game. So I'm going to take this game out of the box. Insert it into my PS4. And then on the racing wheel with the D-pad, we're going to go across to Grand Theft Auto. We're going to start it up with the X. There is an update on the game, but we'll update later because we're not using any network features. We're just hopping in. Right, so there we go. One of the things we're using here is that it's the crosshair converter, right? So this is how it works. The controller for the PS4, which is here, is connected to there. The racing wheel is connected to the crosshair converter. The crosshair converter is then connected to the PS4. It sounds complicated, it absolutely is. And if you think about it, controller goes to crosshair, wheel goes to crosshair, crosshair goes to PS4. And the crosshair converter is about 85 quid from Amazon. It's doing the whole screen calibration thing at the moment, which we don't need to do because we've done that plenty of times before. Obviously, this takes a little while to load. So just remember, steering wheel, to crosshair converter, it looks a little bit like Apple TV. It's a tiny little box here, right? Controller from the PS4 is going to crosshair converter, crosshair converter to PS4. And that way it tricks the PS4 into thinking that this is a game controller for the PS4, where actually it's a racing wheel. So then you get the the pedal functionality. So many people on my channel saying it's a fake. How do you do it? Well, guys, it's not going to work directly. This wheel will not connect to the PS4 and you're going to be able to play Grand Theft Auto 5. Uh -uh, not going to happen. But once you buy one of these bad boys, that's where all the magic does happen. And uh, basically, it's going to make sure that you can do the driving functionality in this game. So, guys, I'm going to mount this now on my tripod. We're going to play some... Grand Theft Auto 5 with a Logitech G29 wheel and pedal. So when we do the cars, we are driving with a wheel. Guys, here it goes on the tripod and let's continue. And before we continue, let me just show you what the D-pad does in this game. So if I click up on the D-pad, we're bringing the mobile out and then we can navigate the mobile phone with the D-pad. And then, of course, we can press O to go back down on the D-pad. Does nothing. That brings out the phone as well. And left on the D-pad does nothing as well. Um, L2. Now, <laughs> L3 prepares us for action. See? Uh, R2. Nothing going on. Oh, there we go, it's changing view. If we click R3, and uh, what we got here, so we got, if we click the options button, we're bringing the options up. Uh, can we use the steering wheel to navigate that? No, can we use the D-pad? Yeah, D-pad to do that. There we go, and we can go back with that. Right, so here we are guys, we're hopped into the game, I'm in the cockpit, I've stolen a car already, which is the Imponti, or Impont. Um, anyway, let me show you how to play this. Remember, wheel to crosshair, controller to crosshair, crosshair to PS4, just remember that. I'm gonna drive, full force feedback, feel that. Whoa! Shooting the lights, obviously, on a misty day. So you can flick through the views here. Let me show you the views. So now we're inside the car. Shooting the lights. I'll show you a bit about what the uh, controller does in just a second on the actual wheel. Not loads, 
Uh, you do have to use the PS4 controller for bits of the game. Just trying to find a different uh, car here. Oh, hang on. <laughs> Woo! Sorry about that. Actually, I'm, I think I'm driving one of them. Ooh, that looks nice. So I can get out by using the triangle. Hello, I'll have you. So yeah, straight into your car by hitting the triangle. Oh, you're trying to fight me, so I can just first person view. I can punch him with the accelerator. He ain't fighting me. I don't want to get back in that car, do I? No, so hit the square. I know the cops are after me as well. So I'm in that car, but I can actually change the view if I need to. The force feedback was absolutely mental in that last car. I don't know if you could uh, see it. It was just complete vibration constantly. This feels a lot nicer actually on the hands. So yeah, we can do that. We're unarmed, we know we are. And then we can hop it inside the car. Should we take a police car? Yeah, shall we? That'd be good. Police ain't gonna like that, are they? So I'm using the controller quickly to jump inside these vehicles. Oh yeah. Proper gonna be wanted now, are they? Oh, whoa. Here we go, so I'm in the police car now. You can see, I'm flicking through the views with the actual sensor on the control pad here. That gives me the different views. up a bit so we can I turn the music off the game for copyright issues because there's tons of that in there <laughs> the cops are there do they know I've got one of their vehicles oh they do oh, I could just reverse and do this guy bye let's go up here shall we Should have known I shouldn't have gone that way. Whoa. I do like being inside the car. I think it works really good. Uh, once I evade these coppers, then I will show you what the actual wheel functionality does. It's not a lot, but what it does do is when you're driving the car, it's like playing a racing game. It's perfect. Wheel rotation's great. Force feedback's good. That force, first car was just giving a bit too much vibration on the wheel, but that's fine. Most of the cars, and I've raced quite a few of them, are just absolutely spot on. So, um, yeah, a lot of people say you can't use a racing wheel in this game. Well, let's hop out of here. Let's nick this car here. Oh, yeah, love that. Hopefully, we evade the cops in this one. So, let's have a look what car we got. Yeah, another one of these. Ah! Ah! that rush hour on the M62? And obviously I've evaded the cops now because they haven't got a clue who on what car I'm in. So yeah, let's hop back in the vehicle. Obviously it's very basic, isn't it? You know the first person view on this game, but just the ability to hop in and drive the cars is just amazing, isn't it? Um, and this is obviously the PS4 version. I'm not sure what you can do on the PC version. I've not even tried. Oh, I like that. I like the look of that. I'm having that. Come here. I am having you. Please. Yeah. Yeah, absolutely getting in this bad boy. Put a reverse on. Nice car. That's a good thing, isn't it? Just take the cars, let's, let's go racing around. When I see a nice car, we're just gonna do it. We're not really in it for doing missions and fighting. We're just, we're having a ride around the world. This is fast. Might even have a go on a scooter. Now I've done previous videos on this game, guys. 
one thing that does annoy me is everybody's like, that is not, that's a fake and all of that. It's not, guys. But what I do want you to understand is that, go on, bye. <laughs> Top in, top in the car. What I do want you to understand is that, guys, you can play this with a racing wheel, but you have to fork out. In America, you're probably talking about $130 for the crosshair converter once it becomes available again. UK, 85 quid. I didn't get it for free. I've given them so much advertising, you'd think by now, you know, I'd be on a percentage <laughs> of sales. Um, but yeah, I, you know, what for me, my ambition on this channel is to show people that because companies don't support games, doesn't mean you can't play them. And uh, of course, I've shown that so many times with the games. Need for Speed, of course, is the current game that's out at the moment, which is a reboot of the 2010 uh, game Hot Pursuit, remastered. And uh, check out my last video on the channel, you'll see it is absolutely possible to, um, should we get the lorry? Actually, he's going to crush me if I stop him, isn't he? Shall, shall I see if I can just spin it round here? Will he stop? <laughs> no, 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 I want that! <laughs> Hijacking a lorry. Stupidest thing ever. Oh, yeah. Let's get it. We're out. Come on. Come on, I don't want to be in first person here, do I? I want to see what I'm doing. I'm going to get in the lorry, have a bit of fun with that. Should we have a fight with the driver first, with the accelerator? Shall we? Yeah, go on. We'll have an accelerator fight, shall we? Press the accelerator to punch him. <laughs> Look. Oh, he wants a fight as well, does he? Oh, is he stepping in? <laughs> it's so surreal, like. And then, obviously, the steering wheel to do it as well. Anyway, I, th I, th I think we've done enough. So let's get in this lorry. This is going to be good. So obviously, oh yeah, look at that. Full force feedback, working great. Video in 4K, by the way, guys. 60 frames a second. So should we, uh, should we hop in? There we go. Oh yeah, I feel king of the road now. I feel like I need some. Juice. Anything to steal there? Oh yeah. The lorry didn't last long. I think that's your car. Not anymore, dude. <laughs> oh, the cops after me already. That's a beast of a car, that isn't it? Let's have a go in that. Totaled it already. Oh, yes. This is what this game is all about, guys. None of this controller nonsense. Woo Coppers. Ah! I think I just died. We're going this way instead. Back out the car a little bit. Actually, should we jump in? Better inside. Fabulous. Fabulous. Give him a shunt. <laughs> oh, should we go the other way? Oh, bless. You just fall into a ditch. out the car for a sec. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Woo. Oh. Who taught you to drive? Me. <laughs> Woo! Logitech G29, you know, it's it's no Fanatec, it's no Thrustmastering. 
in terms of, you know, for arcade racing, I mean, you know, this wheel, probably Black Friday, you're gonna get it at 150 again. Obviously, they've got the uh, G929 now, isn't it? Um, True Force, I think they call it. Ooh! So if Logitech wanna send one my way, for all the advertising I've given for the G29, uh, feel free, I will start using that immediately on my channel, but I don't feel the need to upgrade, if that makes sense. Woo, goodness me, I nearly died. Is it still gonna work? It's still after me. Ain't getting out yet. I'm gonna milk this car for all it's worth. So we go off-road. Let's go off-road. Losing them this way, aren't we? Oh, shit. <laughs> Pardon the language. Woo! Oh, that's what you call serious driving. Oh, they're still there, are they? Let's hop back in the cockpit. Just for that, just for that. I did was steal a car! <laughs> so remember guys, crosshair converter, PlayStation 4 to crosshair, wheel to crosshair, crosshair to PlayStation 4, then you are sorted. You are supported. I need to take another car, don't I really? So let's bring up this view here. Is there anything to steal? I need something fast, don't I? Should I try and evade them in this? No! Yeah, the wheel rotation's perfect as well, you know? This works. Force feedback, as you can see, just mega. Absolutely mega. So yeah, like I say, previous video showing this game, but everybody's kind of doubted it, and I just kind of wanted to make a clearer video to give you the opportunity to see how things are plugged up. Because everybody's like, oh, well, you know, get out of my way, coppers. Point turn it, shall we? <laughs> ah, come on, get out of this spot. Force feedback going crazy, but I might just have evaded them. Oh my god, I'm not getting out of this, am I? There's no way out of this, is there? Why this car blown up yet? It's got to be soon, isn't it? Christ almighty. Come on, cops, give me a break. <laughs> it's still going. Crazy, crazy. Let's go back to the city and get a decent car. Not that this isn't a decent car, but you know what I mean, don't you? Go first person again, shall we? Hop in. And there is a couple of crosshairs that you can get on Amazon actually. One of them is kind of more for target games and Call of Duty and Fortnite and all of that. Christ, I'm never gonna evade this, surely not. That's when you need to kind of hop out. There's no way of getting out of here, is there? No. <laughs> right, let's get out and let's cause these coppers some damage, shall we? Right. Ah, oh, he's got me there. Which is probably a good thing, in fairness. I kind of tested my luck, didn't I, on two stars for ages. 
So let's continue as we go. Um, so obviously we'll come out the cells. We'll be uh, <coughs> looking for another car. <laughs> so obviously we can use the square to kind of toggle our way. <laughs> right, but it's quicker just to kind of yeah do this. I want to get a decent car, so it doesn't feel like the place I'm going to get a decent car. So what I might do is just jump in this car right and just have a slow cruise around and see what we got. I'm going to flick through the views here. As soon as we see a nice sports car or a nice SUV. A bit better in it. Should we get out? Yeah, run across to this one. Hot wired that one quick. Hawkeye Griffo here. Oh, yes. Take your pick.com, isn't it, really? This is a Hummer. I'm in trouble hot wiring that one, aren't you, dude? There were witnesses. There were witnesses. <laughs> right, let's go back to town. Flick through the views, obviously. PS4 controller. Go back into the car, first person view. Do we stop for the lights? Do we help? Station wagon. Oh, that's a nice car. <laughs> Let's just see this car in all its glory, shall we? Oh, I want a lorry. I want to drive that one. It's a proper beast, that, isn't it? I know he's going to want to fight. I don't want to fight, I just want to drive your lorry, so I'm going to reverse to begin with. Oh yeah. Now we are talking, get out of the way Hummer. It was good while it lasted, look at this. King of the road. <laughs> Let's flick through the views. Ah oh, yeah, look at this. I'm just going to deliver my uh, order here. <laughs> it's actually a bit boring in the cockpit, don't you think? You can see force feedback's amazing. Just get it out of there. Woo! Motorbike. That's gonna happen in it soon. It's another hum of that, wasn't it? Lorry's boring. <laughs> Better without the load, isn't it? Yay, let's go. Go back the other way. Do you want to die today? So as I see a nice car, I'm going after it. I thought I'd catch it in this, to be fair. Just having a look at some of the traffic. No, no, no. Out of the way. <laughs> That's what you can do in one of these though. Let's have a look at what there is in the fuel station. Any decent clobber? What's that? Have a go in that, shall we? Actually, that beach buggy looks a bit better, doesn't it? A bit more fun. Yeah, you're gonna go. I'm just gonna do that. I'm just gonna take your motor, dude. Hi. 
Ooh, bye. Run you over as well. All right, I'll let, I'll let you be okay today. <laughs> I bet the uh, the first person view on this vehicle is quite good. Not really. They're, they're just a little bit boring, aren't they? But it's nice to get a first person view because you. I had a better view actually in the lorry, didn't I? To see what cars I want to drive. But at least we're driving a few different ones, aren't we? Which is always good fun. Of course, feedback's crazy in this one. Let's hop out a little bit. What's that? Anything doing? No? All similar. All similar clubber. Oh, look at these bad boys. Yeah, having one of you. Having one of your bikes. Let's go, let's go and get one, shall we? Oh, I've got one star for what? Bad driving. Just look away, guys. You're going to knock one of them off. Just look away. Oh, oh. Hello, come back. Because it's really comical actually that you can actually ride a bike with a steering wheel. Is that a sports car? I don't know why I'm obsessed with sports cars, but I am in this game. I've not seen a really great one yet. Right. There we go. I think he's uh, no longer available. <laughs> but let's, uh, let's get on this bike. <laughs> Look at that. I feel like a hell's angel. Hang on. There we go. So how does the views work on the bikes? Oh my god, this is great. I've got a pistol as well. Oh my god, I'm living the dream. Look at this. Fabulous. Fabulous behaviour. Woo! -woo. This is amazing. Because <laughs> it's like... You know when I talked about the first person view? Ah, oh, no, dead. I've got to be dead. Think bike, guys. Think bike. Goodness me. Is the bike still there? I was enjoying that. But I'm just having a look if there's any better clubber coming past. Now let's get back on the bike. Let's think about this. Be brave. Get back on it. Obviously, we're in third person view. Bring up the controller. Flick through the views. Actually, it's quite cool seeing him from behind, but actually on the bike. When I was talking before, before I actually crashed, I was talking about that first person view in the car and having the windscreen. And this being on the bike is kind of. Ah! <laughs> I felt that. I absolutely felt that. The only thing is now you have to kind of come out of that just to see where your bike is. I don't see it anymore. But I do see a lorry. <laughs> Get a lorry. Can I ever go? Or do you want to fight first? Should we fight for your lorry? Should we fight? I want to fight for your lorry. I want to hit you with my accelerator. Ah, oh, come on. Yeah. so violent so violent griffo right let's get in this let's have a go i wish there was a load of porsches on the back so i could back one off and uh oh look at that for a cockpit more pit than cock mm. Yes, sports car. I'm never going to catch you though, am I? <laughs> got, got to see this in the uh, the non-so third-person view. That's the car after. It looked nice going past. 
is it as nice as oh yeah it looks all right that doesn't it that's the one we're getting yeah absolutely looks like um a ferrari and an audi r8 that kind of clobber doesn't it absolutely having your car do no two ways about it don't even want to fight you for it just i'm just taking it you are kidding me are you <laughs> fighting you with my accelerator right and then triangle let's get in right right god this is a fast one Oh yeah. So look at that. Yeah, okay. Woo Here we go. Nice car to drive. Having a bit of this. Wanted by two coppers. Not going to catch me in this bad boy. No! Chance. Oh, is there? Oh my god, some serious driving there. Woohoo! No, you don't. No, you don't. No, you don't. Time to find a new car, though, I think. stars are you giraffing me I want to swap carriageways because at the moment I'm oh <laughs> sorry animal lovers I'm sorry I didn't see it Woo! 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 this is where you need to be first person Evading them because they're flashing. through the views what do you reckon guys do you like nah. they think I'm getting that car I'm not, not cuz by the time I got out ah! These little bad boys. Sorry. <laughs> yes, I'm brave enough to go off road. Watch this. Woohoo! <laughs> Just land on the wheels. Just land on the wheels. Land on the wheels. Attention to detail in this game is absolutely phenomenal, isn't it? No 
train, just no train. Full speed back. Gonna leave this game in a minute and uh, yeah, you draw your own conclusions, guys. Is it worth buying a cross air converter? Absolutely. Let's go up this mound here. Go on, go on, go on, go on. Whoa! That's where we're going to leave it, guys. Yeah, is it worth getting a cross air converter? Absolutely. It's not just for this game, it's for plenty of others. G29 still works a treat for me. Uh, a few guys have had it. Well, I've had mine for three years now, and it still works as good as it did on the first day. It's played a lot of hours of uh, driving games, that is for sure. This is it then, Grand Theft Auto, Logitech G29, wheel and pedals. Thanks for checking me out. See you soon, guys. Comments below. I'll answer as many as I can. Am I going to die? Shall I go and hunt them? Oh, that's a way to go, isn't it?